Hey guys, what's up? And today I'm going to be showing you how to install the slime mod for Minecraft 1.8.1. Now, what this mod does is basically when you press F3, uh, basically you know how it shows all the stuff. It basically adds these two things. So it shows your seed depending on where you are. And then if slimes spawn in the area like around you. Um, so yeah, that's what this mod does. And uh, yeah, I'm going to show you how to install it. So first, what you want to do is visit the description, and under downloads, there will be two links. You want to click on both. The first one will just take you here, which is just the mod page itself, and then the second one will take you to WinRAR. Now, uh, what you want to do over there is just install that program. It should be pretty easy. I mean, just click like download, and then just run the exe, and then you should have the program in no time. So uh, yeah, you can also get 7-zip if you want. But yeah, that just them programs just allow you to open a file we will download now. So uh, yeah, uh, go here, uh, down here once you have WinRAR, and uh, you want to go to vanilla and then 1.8.1, and you just want to click download here. Once you do that, it's going to start downloading, and once it's done, you can just drag this to the side, get that file, and just drag it to your desktop. Uh, let me just... There we go. Alright, uh, so yeah, you should have that on your desktop. And once you have that, you can close your browser. Actually, no. Well, unless you want to close the video, but uh, yeah, anyway. Uh, you can close that, and then what you want to do here is find our Minecraft folder. So to do that, press the Windows key and R at the same time, and that's going to bring up this run thing. Basically, in here, you just want to type in percentage app data percentage. Then you want to press OK, so once you've got that in. Press OK and that'll bring you to your roaming folder. And uh, once you get to here, you want to look to you want to look for a folder called dot Minecraft. It's usually going to be up the very top based on the alphabet because dots are first. Um, so yeah, go into that dot Minecraft. Then you want to go into versions. And right here, you should have one folder or maybe more. But as long as you have one, what says 1.8.1 you're good. Uh, if you don't, basically that just means you have to run the latest version of Minecraft at least once. So just do that and then you'll get this folder. Okay, so once you've got this folder, you just want to right click on it, copy, and in this open space here, just right click, paste. Uh, that's wrong, not the shortcut, just right click, paste, not shortcut, just paste. Then you want to right click on the new one, so the new folder you just duplicated, right click on it, rename, and you want to name it to anything you want really but uh, to make it simple just name it slime mod just like that so once you've done that go into that folder then highlight these two files right click rename and you want to rename it to whatever you name that folder so make it exactly the same so just slime mod and press enter now you've renamed those two files to what you name that folder what did I just do oh, okay all good. Alright, so once you've done that, you want to get this JSON file and you want to right click on it, open with Notepad or like Word or just anything that can like edit text. So like Notepad's good, uh, that also comes with a computer, so just click that. Once you've done that, what you want to look for is 1.8.1. You want to highlight it, delete it, and replace it with what you name these two files and that folder. So just slime mod all right so once you've done that file save and once you exit this you've now basically just made a duplicate of the normal version of minecraft and you've just named it slime mod so now all we have to do is just add the our mod to that version okay so to do that what you want to do is get this winrar file and right click on it open with winrar and uh, if it doesn't come up just click choose default program more options and then just find WinRAR on this list. Uh, so that's the program you should have downloaded. So yeah, just click that and uh, then it'll open this file, well this jar file with WinRAR and uh, then what you want to do is look for a folder called meta-inf. You want to highlight it, right click on it, delete and then click yes. And uh, once you've done that you want to open the mod file with WinRAR as well. So just right click, open with WinRAR. Again if it doesn't come up just do what you did for that file. So yeah, right click open with WinRAR. Once you've done that you basically want to highlight all these files here so just drag and then you want to drag them into your slime mod.jar so just drag your cursor into here and then let go 
and then it'll say add and replace yep just press OK and uh, once you've done that you have basically finished installing the mod so you've set up the version and uh, now all you have to do is just add that version to your Minecraft you can also delete this so right click delete just in case you don't know how to delete that would be slightly concerning but uh, yeah anyway alright so once you've got the Minecraft open you want to click new profile uh, also if we select this you can go edit and uh, the latest version, so that's the version it's using, that was the 1.8.11, 1.8.11, anyway, uh, this is just the latest version of Minecraft, this is that folder we saw, what we duplicated, so yeah, uh, just a thing to keep in mind, so yeah, uh, press the new profile button here, and you want to name it to whatever you want, doesn't matter at all, just keep in mind that this is the profile with your slime mod, so maybe name it slime mod pretty simple but yeah that works uh, then where it says use version you want to click this arrow here then you want to click release slime mod so click that and save profile and then to launch the mod you just select that profile and press play alright so once you've got in game uh, I'll show you it works real quick by uh, just creating a world oh Jesus what is this All right. turn the sound off because it's just annoying really alright uh, creative and uh, then when you press F3 you will see that it'll say your seed uh, where you are and then it'll say if slime spawns so uh, right we're in uh, so if we press F3 uh, as you can see uh, there I can't point to it but uh, in the sort of middle left you can see seed and then it says the seed I guess that's just the seed of the world not depending on where you are but yeah it says that and it also says if slime spawn uh, like where I am now so uh, I'll be back when I find a place where I'm spawn alright so uh, as you can see here we are it says no but slime chunk so we just need to find the height so obviously just dig down oh, God. block off that water All right. so just dig down and uh, then you will see it's a bit dark but yeah anyway Alright, so yeah, uh, as you can see now, it says yes, so if I just dig around, I should be able to find some slimes. You know, you might need to find a cave or something. But uh, yeah, that's basically it, and uh, that's how you know it works. If it didn't, please leave a comment, and I'll try to help you as much as I can. And uh, yeah, thank you guys for watching. If you did enjoy this video, please give it a like, and subscribe if you're new, and I'll see you all later.